a man who earned the name Impaler, wasn't exactly known for his hospitality. Meet Vlad the Impaler, the chilling inspiration behind the famed Dracula character. Born in 1431 in Romania's Carpathian Mountains, his father's membership in the Order of the Dragon significantly shaped his later life. This was only the beginning of a life steeped in blood and violence. Vlad's youth was spent in a turbulent era, shaping him into a fearsome ruler. As a hostage in the Ottoman Empire, he learned the ways of power and cruelty. These harsh lessons forged his brutal ruling style, a chilling blend of strategy and savagery. His reign of terror was about to begin. Once on the throne, Vlad's lust for power and blood was insatiable. His reign was marked by both strategic military successes and unflinching brutality. His infamous method of impalement struck fear into the hearts of his subjects and enemies alike. This wasn't a leader who merely ruled, he terrorized. His barbarity was such that his very name became a byword for fear. Even as he managed to hold his kingdom together with a ruthless grip, his infamy grew. His reputation was spreading, and his name would forever be associated with terror. Death did not extinguish the legend of Vlad the Impaler. His demise, shrouded in mystery and intrigue, only fueled the flames of his infamy. His reign, marked by a river of blood, found an echo in Bram Stoker's Dracula, immortalizing Vlad as a pivotal figure in vampire lore. This infamous ruler, remembered for his sadistic pleasure in impalement, has transcended time. Vlad the Impaler, a ruler drenched in blood, lives on, not as a man, but as the embodiment of our darkest fears.